<laughs> well, gentlemen, now I believe we are talking turkey. Formidable Google. Merci, Brady. Okay, so, like I was saying, Mr. Brainwash, you don't have to worry about anything. Doesn't matter if you've never acted before. You don't have to believe in yourself. All that matters is that everyone else believes in you. But forgive me, my friend. How does this make sense? Well, if you're having a hard time, sometimes you need the support of others to help you out of it. Wah. So, you don't even have to be strong because other people are being strong for you. Oh, I think I see. It's like the story of the footprints on the beach. Uh, that does not sound like much of a story. Uh, footprints on a beach, uh, fairly commonplace, no? Well, there's a little more to it than that. See you play, go, go. Continue. Well, there's this fellow on a beach, and he gets tired because walking on sand is a drudgery. He calls out to the heavens, Oh, Lord, will you pick me up and carry me? And the Lord appears and says, Hop on. Um. Well, they go down to the ocean, and the fellow says, Take me across, Lord. And the Lord says, How do I know you won't poison me? John? And the fellow responds, Well, then, we'd both drown. So the Lord agrees. Halfway across the ocean, the fellow asks the Lord if he wouldn't mind turning the sea into poison and taking a big gulp of it. John. And the Lord says, I already did. And he dives below the surface with a man on his back. Three days later, the Lord ascends to heaven because he'd been taking minute doses of the poison to build up an immunity. I'll admit I may be embellishing a little. When I first heard that story, I tuned out at the walking on the beach part. The sand gets everywhere. No thank you. Anyway, Mr. Brainwash, don't worry about anything. Uh, but this business of uh, creating a character, uh, what am I to do? Well, why don't you just be yourself? Pardon? Yeah, I mean, we're all allowed to be whoever we want to be. Why don't you be you? Then you don't have to worry about acting at all. That does sound easier. John, that's brilliant! Brady, you won't have to worry about being completely immobile anymore. You just have to sit there like the glue-clogged husk you are and sing! About which would I sing? I do not even know what the story of this story is. No one does. And you don't even have to worry about anything else. Just your own character, which is you. So it's your story. It's up to Andrew Lloyd Webber to make sense of it. Fellas. I've been struck by the most marvelous inspiration. The other non-actors should play themselves as well! What do you mean? Well, Andrew Lloyd Webber, and Gary Marshall, and the Cake Boss! Cake, cake Boss? And Ice-T! Um, Ice-T's actually acting in the movie. Oh, of course you're right. But what do you think? I think it sounds... Awesome! Huzzah! I'll call Ice-T and tell him the good news! We're on our way! Oh, uh, pardon me, dear. Can we have the alley phone brought to our lane? It's an important call. Here, just use my cell. No, I wanted to look like a big shot.